I just got my package from Uniform Advantage and the bag is very cute. It says, obviously you have a really great taste. good really great so now I need to see if these freaking fit me this looks so much better than the set before fits nicely I bought three pairs of this one and I'm very glad that I bought three pairs of this style love that so we know for sure that these fits I can take the thing off Should have had the autofocus on the whole time so i'm pretty sure the other clip is out of focus but we're gonna just speed it up but um i ended up stopping by the nail salon to fix my nails i made them way shorter so i made them shorter and y'all can't even see the cut let's see made them extremely shorter and like a nude color that you know, it's very professional and very short, and these are indeed my nails. And it was very painful to have to cut them down, but you gotta do what you gotta do. So, um, did that. Now I'm home. Jules cooked food today and brought for me and another one of our friends. So I'm gonna have that and um, clean up around here. I'm gonna go on the website and maybe shop around for a few more pairs of scrubs because you're gonna wear them all the time anyways, so you can never have too much. And they're really good quality, so we're gonna do that. And um, because working there for however long, I'm gonna need as many. So I'm gonna do that, clean up around here, and later. Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm just coming home from the grocery store. And gosh, when I tell you outside is hot, it's not a joke. But um, I spent a good $300 inflation. I bought a nice thing of salmon. So excited about that, but I decided to take it with me because the salmon is very soft and I did not want to break it up. I had also stopped by the Dollar Tree because I needed some more hangers, so I bought three packs of six. So I have 18 new hangers. They're not the colors that I wanted. I wanted white, but can't always get everything that you want. They didn't have white, they had black. And they also had the um, the velvet ones, but I'm not buying two for 125. I think I bought loads before for cheaper. And I also brought my sandwich meat with me I have um, ham and roast beef. That's all I brought with me because I just feel like I already spent so much money they need to deliver all of it, but I was very particular about the salmon. So I brought that home with me and I also bought this little book at the Dollar Tree because my orientation starts tomorrow and I'm pretty sure I'm going to need like a little book to be able to like jot things down in. So there's this. That's what we're going to use that for. And that's specifically what I went to the Dollar Tree to buy. And that's all I left with. So proud of me. 
For a while I was going back and forth between this book and another one, but I ended up deciding on this one because I think it's cute. And um, so now I wait for the delivery people to bring the groceries and I can already tell y'all. I didn't buy any water, I didn't buy any sparkly. There's like a little bit of spark. I couldn't, bubbly, I couldn't find any bubbly. The water, there's a whole case left and they didn't have any deals on the water they had. And the cranberry juice was a little expensive, so I did not buy that. So maybe now I'm gonna go on Target and I'm gonna buy the bubbly because I know it's cheaper on there. I had checked and the cranberry juice. So yeah, everything else on my grocery list though, I did buy that stuff. So I have more than enough hangers for my new scrubs, which I need to steam today. So I'm good for the week. So I'm gonna do that at some point today. I also need to wash my hair. There's a lot that I have to do today, which makes sense that I tell them that my, um, Family emergency started today, so I could have a day at home to rest, which doesn't look like any resting is going to be going on. Oh, I have another package. I'm going to show you guys. Today's trash day, which is like the perfect time to go to the grocery store. Everybody knows this checkered box. Is it checkered? Whatever it is. Bath and Body Works are having their semi-annual sale. Was it that? Which I need to go on there in about 15 minutes, I think. Or maybe it's time to go on there. And I bought a few little items just because when they're having the sale, it's not really good. I bought this fresh coconut um, body mist, and I bought this water, fresh coconut colada, and I bought this watermelon lemonade. They both smell so good individually, but together, oh, they smell amazing. And then I bought the one thing that I actually went on there to buy. They were having a sale on hand soaps and the last time I bought was in Black Friday Black Friday so that was months ago and I still have two left however this was such a good sale like they, they even had some that were for like a dollar something 149 or something like that I didn't get any of the ones that were 149 because I put them in my cart and then just, that just didn't work out but I got a few I got peach bellini I have wild honeysuckle just some really nice ones and it doesn't even matter what it smells like i don't think the smell is going to bother me cozy vanilla cream black tie you know i just needed to get enough i think i got about 10 or 12 2 4 6 wow 8 10 i actually got 12 and that should last for the rest of the year and into next year if i'm using one per month this should last me if we're using one per month, gosh, you know men use things real hard. If we're using one per month, they should last us until next year when they have this semi-annual sale again. So we'll see. We're really not banking on it because men, they use things hard. I'm not nervous about the orientation tomorrow, but I actually can't wait for it to start so I can see like what it's about, you know, what the job is about, that part. So yeah, when I spend so much money at the grocery store, I'm going to be cooking for the next month because that's a lot of money. This inflation is pissing me off. But um, yeah, this is all things that I bought. For now, the groceries are going to be coming soon. So I need to keep my phone on me to hear when the person calls me. And this is not like my other grocery store where the guy will like literally bring the containers inside and up at the top of the stairs and I always, always tip him with this man. He parks his car inside and he brings it to the door. So that's the service. If that's the service, then that's not worthy of a tip. I need to clean up around here. I just realized as well that I'm gonna need to figure out which bag I'm gonna take with me tomorrow and fix that today. It's 147, so I have a lot that I need to do in what I feel like is the smallest amount of time. Luckily, the orientation does not start at the crack of dawn at 8 a.m., so that's great. I did not buy any candles because I feel like one, two, three, four. I still have four left. The one on the table is barely burnt. One in the bedroom, you know, which will last for the rest of this year. But not only that, I feel like I quite like the candles that I bought at Marshall's before because they last a longer time and they're like huge for a fraction of the price. So I guess I decided that I'm going to stick to buying those. 
But if they're having a good sale for $10, absolutely. Absolutely. Which, the last time I did buy so many candles, I bought it when they were having, yeah, I think it was Black Friday or their annual sale. I don't know. But it was a really good price and I bought a lot. So right now that I'm done packing what I already have away, I think I'm gonna just sit and wait for the man to come with my stuff. So yeah, and I'm telling you, this time I was very intentional about bringing the reusable bags that I have because I refused to go to the store and buy more and it worked out so much because everything that I had fit in all the reusable bags that I brought. So we're gonna do that from here on out because I'm not buying no more bags.